In this video, I'm going to talk about stacks, layer two to Bitcoin. What is layer two? Layer two is a blockchain that is some way connected to layer one blockchain. Uh, in this case, that is Bitcoin. It can be either by a consensus mechanism, by somehow bundling transactions on layer two so that one, once they are sent to layer one, uh, they can be paid cheaply in gas or they're faster uh, validated. There's a bunch of things like that, mechanics that allows you to add, for example, more applications on top of uh, existing blockchain. So what Stax is trying to do, it's actually trying to bring both DeFi and NFTs to Bitcoin. So what's the relation with ordinals? Because that's the recent talk of the town when it comes to Bitcoin. Uh, actually, it's very uh, incorporated within the Stacks itself. Uh, so Stax actually came with NFTs before ordinals. And right now they try to incorporate the ordinals within the stacks as well. Uh, and thanks to the existing NFT marketplaces, you can actually create ordinals using stacks as well and bring them this way to Bitcoin. So I'm, gonna to, I'm going to show you that uh, in a moment, but let's have a look at stacks itself. As you can see, a Bitcoin layer for smart contracts, stacks is, build, uh, is bringing its own smart contract programming language, which means that you can actually build a applications, decentralized applications on top of Bitcoin, uh, giving it a lot of functionality. So proof of, of transfer, the consensus mechanism that connects stacks and Bitcoin. Uh, then you have Bitcoin DeFi and Bitcoin NFTs that uh, are coming to uh, Bitcoin thanks to stacks. Uh, Really, the coin had a quite a run recently because there's, of course, a stacks coins related to uh, to the blockchain. Uh, so you can see that it did 50% in the in the last 24 hours, and it's getting a lot of attention recently uh, because basically people discovered that there's a connection between uh, ordin Bitcoin ordinals, Bitcoin NFTs and stacks. So this one uh, is definitely there's a, a narrative behind it, uh, and it makes sense uh, now. Uh, for the for the uh, stacks itself, uh, you can basically use stacks to, for example, stake your bitcoins, so earn some kind of a yield, uh, or use bitcoin to basically buy uh, different uh, different stuff on stacks. So th thanks to to the stacks, you can basically build those kind of applications, decentralized applications, and also find uh, different NFTs. If you go to the website stacks.co you'll be able to see uh, what kind of applications are being built the community is growing and for example if you go to find nfts uh, you'll be able to explore what's possible with uh, uh, with uh, stacks so for example bridging bringing nfts to bitcoin you can discover different projects there's a project called gamma gamma.io uh, where uh, you can actually find Bitcoin NFTs and also create an ordinal in minutes. Uh, this is really cool because if you click on that, you see that there's a five way process where you actually can inscribe something directly on to the Bitcoin blockchain, which is pretty, pretty cool and easy to use. And also you can see the whole marketplace for, for the collections. Uh, everything is in Stacks tokens uh, listed here. It's on layer two, uh, but you can always bridge, bridge it to uh, layer one to Bitcoin, uh, which is pretty cool, uh, or, or at least in most cases you can uh, you can bridge it. Uh, now, for the Stacks, you can also discover the ecosystem of different applications. Uh, with DeFi, uh, you can go to see a bunch of applications as well. So let's have a look at the ecosystem for uh, for the applications. Uh, there's a lot of a lot of stuff here getting started. Uh, and basically people are really building a lot of stuff on this layer too. So from things like uh, domains, uh, advanced wallets, uh, different kind of uh, DeFi applications, more stuffs are uh, more stuff is happening here on the stacks, you can see everything. Uh, here that is being done and you can basically go and check each project one by one so as you can see this is the this is really a vibrant community and something that uh, bitcoin really needed meaning you have more applications on top of bitcoin so that you can actually use bitcoin to do a bunch of stuff rather than just uh, holding forever uh, so this is the basically stacks really interesting uh, projects for all the people in the bitcoin community uh, and also if you're into uh, ordinals if you want to do uh, bitcoin nfts this is an easy way to get into that world so definitely check it out uh, as i've mentioned the token had quite a run recently so always do your research before buying 
uh, any kind of token like that. Uh, this is purely educational video, so not a financial advice, uh, but definitely worth checking out uh, stacks. Uh, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more updates on uh, Bitcoin ordinals, on uh, NFTs, DeFi protocols, and so on. I have also two videos with tutorials into Bitcoin ordinals explaining what are they and how you can get started. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.